What is up mga soldiers and welcome back to my channel This is your guy, your average sneaker guy Japot and again we are on the streets We're looking for some pairs and we're looking for some hustle Some high side hustle At syempre nga trabaho tayo Well guys this is just a quick uh, vlog no uh, Actually hindi siya un unboxing no It's sort of uh, kung nakita nyo sa title and sa thumbnail natin uh, Meron akong Yeezy pair which is the Yeezy 700 V3 that I've been using for almost 2 weeks already. So, hindi ko siya finiture dito sa vlog as unboxing. Uh, gusto ko lang kasi ma-feel muna yung, yung vibes kasi this is the first time na nagkaroon ako ng ganito. And this is uh, one of the Yeezys na hindi siya boost technology. So, I wanted to feel the comfort and overall, overall na style niya so before ko i-review sa inyo para mas mas damang daman nyo naman yung review ko ba? so yun na nga so pakita ko na sa inyo yung aking Hayonite Hayonite yes sir this is the Yeezy 700 uh, V3 uh, Hayonite colorway and I love the colorway kasi very ano siya very muted and uh, hindi siya ganun ka loud hindi tulad ng mga nauna and as you can see it's, it's quite sa unang impression pa lang sa unang tingin nyo pa lang makifeel nyo na na comfortable siya so before sa initial ano ko, uh, review ko with this in terms of comfort uh, puntahan natin yung mga materials na ginamit dito, dito which is so so sick kasi ano lang parang as you can see futuristic yung kanyang dating diba so yung mga recent uh, 700 releases T80 releases parang mga alien ang dating nila ayan mababansin nyo naman kung ikot-ikot natin yan so going with the materials of this pair uh, this is a one constructed shoe so ibig sabihin uh, walang tang yan so yung tang is embedded or stitched mismo sa outer layer ng sapatos and at the same time uh, hindi siya fully ano, uh, what I mean is fully constructed although meron mga parts dito na yung laces niya is uh, yung insert ng laces niya dito ayan, the strings there and uh, so combination siya ng uh, textile actually sa upper as you can see ito parang uh, embroidered uh, part this looks like a uh, teal blue no parang teal blue siya na nagiging parang greenish pagdating dito sa lower part uh, so nagiging parang teal na teal siya and uh, definitely uh, very subtle to itong yung colorway na to so sa so medial side ayan yung upper as you can see uh, it is covered with this textile ayan and itong textile na to is uh, a mix of uh, embroidered na, na pattern at meron siyang mesh no for me meron siyang mesh na makikita niyo siya and you will as, as you look here this is the mesh no yes actually yung mesh niya hindi hindi ganoon ka white ha? i mean hindi siya ganoon ka transparent so hindi masyado din man makikita yung inyong socks so outer layer of that ganoon and then merong uh, new buck material here sa toe area and of course uh ito yung highlight of this uh, upper itong rubber covering ribs ito, ito yung parang rib, rib type which makes the shoe looks like an alien diba? so ito po uh, this one glows in the dark so mapapansin nyo siya medyo creamy na sort of greenish pag uh, na expose sa sunlight and yun nga, napakaganda niya glow in the dark siya so once you were directly sa sunlight and then pumasok sa madilim it really really pops out yung pagka glow in the dark niya one great picture ng sapatos na to and as we go at the tongue dito, ito naman is a 3M reflective uh, material so magre-reflect yan so once matutukan siya ng uh, light so like I've said, this is a one shoe uh, construct uh, constructed shoe and uh, yun nga, itong padded na tongue nya pupunta na tayo sa tongue, isang buong sya so it is padded up to here, but if you can you can look at the inside, hindi buo yan no? andito na makikita nyo na yung mesh part so hanggang dito sya 
So very comfortable. Uh, wala siyang heel uh, pull tab. Wala siyang heel pull tab kasi for me ah, it's very easy to put your uh, uh, your feet on this no kasi yung ankle niya dito, dito siya magro-rock. So magi-slide siya dito. But dahil nga wala siyang tang uh, uh, dun sa mga wide footer, medyo mahirap siya isuot. So I suggest uh, yung mga super wide footer you go one size up. And ito nga yung uh, yung mga recent na releases ng Yeezy ni Kanye. Uh, buo yung laces. Although this comes with an extra lace which is black then. Pero magkahiwalay siya. So ito yung pinupull na lang na lace. Yan. So mga 2 years ago releases, 1 year ago releases. Ito yung ganito. So you will adjust that. So technically ako I went through to size in here para ma-feel ko yung snugness kasi wala nga siyang lace ayoko naman putulin at gamitin yung extra lace uh, so saktong sakto lang sa akin yung pair I can feel the comfort and uh, it really really makes me ano uh, like the shoe more better so let's go sa midsole eto nga yung sinasabi natin uh, hindi siya boost mukha siyang boost pero for me, pag ginawa tong boost, mas lalong komportable itong sapatos na to. Well, I don't know kung ano yung technology na ginamit dito. No? It's really, really, hindi ganun ka soft. Pero pag nirock mo yung paa mo sa loob, you walk it, grabe, komportable pa rin siya as in. So sa heel, makita nyo yung performance uh, logo ni Adidas there. And what makes this uh, uh, very, very unique is yung kanyang outsource. So the outsoles is a herring bone pattern with a gum sole. Ang ganda lang it it matches its color talaga. And makita nyo, di ba? Dapat sa, sa Wave Runners, sa mga 700 V1s and V2, naka boost sila. Makita nyo exposed boost. Eto, dito nyo mararamdaman sa ilalim yung uh, cushioning nya. No, I don't know kung ano talagang ginamit dito, but it's really comfortable. Comfortable and eto mga Uh, pad holes na to uh, makes you wonder kung bakit siya naging komportable kasi nag-expand din yung rubber na technology ginamit dito. although yung cage niya dito is really not that uh, very very uh, soft kasi ang hirap din siya i-touch but I think yung ikinage dito was the technology na nandito which is in teal green ayan o, oh, ang lambot niya for me parang cloud foam siya uh, sort of like Nike Sria also but This is nice, no? Siguro bounce to na mas, ano, mas premium. And it's, wala lang, napapawaw lang talaga. So, pumunta na tayo, guys, sa comfort nito. After two weeks of usage, uh, hella good. Yun lang masasabi ko. It's hella good. Uh, you know, um, wala ang na-create na creases, even sa midsole, wala. So, ginagamit, ginamit ko talaga siya roughly, no? It's just uh, parang sa driving hindi ko rin siya masyadong magamit but I don't drive no while using my pairs kasi ganun ko sila kamahal. Sa paglalakad hindi ko alam bakit ganito ko komportable siya. Uh, bakit ganun siya ka yung feel ng ang lambot talaga eh pag tinatapak mo talaga siya eh. Gilong 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 gilo. And with its structure no ayun nga no. Nakikita niyo dito medyo may arc yung sa heel. So, di ba pag naglalakad ka ganyan. So, ang ganda lang ng ng feel, no. Kasi when you're when you're walking, ganito yung comfortable. So, it would feel ito yung surface. So, syempre pag magwo-walk ka ganyan and then like that. And that is why siguro ang easy is uh, parang gustong ipalabas ni Kanye na performance ano to eh, sapatos din. So, ayan na. Uh, performance logo yung gamit niya, but uh ang hirap lang gamitin kasi sobrang ganda niya. Imagine mo gagamitin mo ito sa gym Overall fit naman ito um, For me siguro You go through to your to your size no? And I went 9 here So yung mga normal Yeezys ko eh, 9.5 ako doon Especially the 350s So I went size 9 for this one Kung feeling nyo parang masakit siya Hindi po sobrang lambot po nito The upper kasi parang if you can see the the material, the texture of it, uh, parang plastic siya, hindi po. It would not hurt your feet at all. Promise. 
promise well if you will rock the Yeezy 700 V3 for me it's a 1 out of 10 for me it's a 10 now, 10 siya sa akin but uh, syempre 11 yung Yeezy 350s in terms of Yeezy's nasa, nasa pinaka top yun but having without the boost no? kaya ako siya ni-rate ng 10 having without the boost technology uh, sobrang komportable na siya na feeling mo parang boost din siya na nasa mid mid medial part so ganun ganun kaganda yung comfort nitong uh, sapatos na to so that's it for today mga soldiers ito nga yung EC700 V3 na Kyanite and uh hindi na siya available for retail as we all know Yeezys are are purchased on a raffle uh, registration so upon the release date so matagal na itong Yeezy Kyanite and it's almost more than a year and you can cop there sa mga, mga special boutiques, thrift shops or the resellers there yung trusted resellers nyo kasi ingat po tayo sa mga fakes at counterfeits and yun so kung mahilig naman talaga kayo and your hype beast uh, this is worth the money and uh, it would really turn heads no? pag uh, nirorock na siya or naglalakad kayo out so that's it for today mga soldiers thank you thank you very much sa mga bagong uh, subscribers natin uh, hindi mamit na natin 1000 subscribers guys please do like mag comment din kayo kasi makakatulong yan sa algorithm natin and if I would reach the 1,000 subscriber, my plan is to give something for the charity and at the same time, I'm planning for a uh, contest at namiss kong mamigay ng sapatos o mamigay ulit tayo ng sapatos para sa mga may gusto ng sapatos dyan. So guys, thank you mga soldiers and I'll see you again on my next vlog and magingat po kayo, stay safe pa rin, alert level number 2, uh, I hope dere derecho na to at wala nang mangyayaring pandemic and guys yun spread the love share your blessings and always pray may bago ako no keep safe guys and adios